What's up everybody? This is the Awesome Nerd Show and today bring you another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Um, so of course we're here on the center map as usual, playing with our um, in our small little base we have here, surrounded off by spike walls and our door and everything. Um, so I think for um, this episode, I think the goal is to try and get all this switched over um, from thatch to wood. Um, so we have some materials gathered up in these crates here to switch everything over and I think I have most, um, mostly everything I need unlocked hopefully because I'm out of Ingram points and everything. So hopefully um, we can get that uh, finished or switched over today and I would kind of like to maybe make it a bigger size, um, not necessarily but um, that's like a goal and everything and then um, possibly put up a fence around um, the base here instead of these spike walls um, and maybe expand it out a little more to um, have room to grow and everything um, so I guess we'll just start by crafting uh, some walls so I should have uh, plenty of wood in these crates and everything um, hopefully I can reach everything so grab a couple stacks here and we'll go in um, we'll need to make foundations first, and I believe, um, there are six of them, four, yeah, six, so we'll have to make all those, and hopefully that'll be enough to do all that, Let's see how many walls, so two walls so far, one ceiling, um, we can go ahead and make the door, f and, yeah, the door frame and the door, so we have those set up. Um, we'll go ahead and move the foundations down here into our slot. Let this finish crafting up. Ooh, and we got a level. So once again, we're gonna put in more weight and then see what we can unlock next. Cause I know we do have the clothes now. I'm starting to get into the wood and it looks like that's it so far. So we need the preserving bin. Um, so I guess I'll go ahead and use the points and it looks like that will finish off the points on the gloves and the hat and then we'll need to save up to get this refining forge, the preserving bin, um, the wood can wait a while or the stone stuff can wait a while because I'm not in that big of a hurry for it but we'll want to get the um, smithy unlocked and then of course all the metal tools. Um, to be able to help to expand and everything. Um, so let's see what we have so far. Let's see about some walls possibly. So it looks like we're running out of wood. So go ahead and get into this crate. Get some more wood out. And see how many walls we can craft up. So there's 14. I'm not sure if that's as many as we need or anything but that's what we're gonna start out with at least put the door frame down in there and then hopefully well, we can move a little at least we'll go ahead and start placing some of these um, foundations being encumbered is not fun place that and come on there we go ah there's too much thatch everywhere go away go 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 I can't see and then the last one so it looks like that was plenty of foundations so now we've got all the switched over to wood and we'll go ahead and replace this door frame here and then go back into our inventory and we'll put the walls down and the door. Go ahead and switch this door out. Open that. Now we'll switch start switching out these walls. I think that we'll have plenty of walls, but we like I said, I want to put a wall around the entire base. So whatever's left we can obviously just um, use for that. So switching all of these over, then we'll have to get ceilings made, 
and see if we've ran out of materials yet. Oh no, looks like we won't have any walls left over. We'll need to make some more actually. So it looks like we need one more wall. Okay. So let's see what we need. So I assume it's just wood. So that's all of our chests. So we can make, let's make some of the ceilings. So we only need four ceilings and then we'll make that. Um, let's see. Yeah, we'll just make that last wood wall for now. Let's put the ceilings there. Okay. So put up the last wall. There we go. And I'll come in here and put up the ceilings. They just go in whatever direction, I guess. So now we have our um, building completely converted over to wood, so now it's a little stronger. Um, like I said in the first episode, though, I have the um, like building damage, I believe, turned off. So we shouldn't really have to worry about that anyways, but it's just for that extra layer of security and everything. Then, of course, we have Mikey over here. Ooh, and he does have a level. So go ahead. I don't know what we should pump on him. Um, so I've been doing weight, which I think he's only got a couple levels so far, but I've been doing, um, weight so that, uh, he can hold more stuff for us, of course. Um, so we have our mortar and pestles. So I wonder what else we could make. Um, I guess we could possibly work, start working on, uh, the fence foundations. Um, maybe a large storage. Let's see how many. Five. I know I will want a lot of those. Um, but I think maybe we should, uh, get a wall, a uh, fence going on first. So there's 26. That'll be, um, a good amount to start out with. And while we're in here, we'll go ahead and, uh, finish. See how much we can get crafted up with our gloves. And it looks like we need more, um, something or fiber it's not showing up but we've got another level um, so let's see what should we put it into um, I guess we'll just keep going and wait until we get to 400 and then we'll worry about uh, putting points into other um, things so we can't get the forge yet so it looks like we may just hold off of buying anything until we can get that forge um, because then we have the preserving bin, but it's not a complete necessary thing right now since we have the turtle and he's probably doing just as good a job. So I don't, must be the hide, yeah. So we need to get more hide to craft those uh, gloves or hat or whichever one it was. But I don't see any, but um, so I did uh, do some crafting between um, the last episode and now. Um, and also in doing that I was able to unlock the trank arrows so I made some trank arrows with the narcotic that I had um, and so now we have those set up down there on the bows and I think that was pretty much all that I had got done um, I just gathered materials and everything to put in these chests so this one's also filled with thatch and fiber um, but I think that's it probably of all that I um, was able to do I was only uh, could only play for a few minutes and everything so I wasn't able to get a whole lot done Let's see hopefully there's no dangerous things out here I believe the bears still off in the distance there um, and there's that trike over there which I would um, I really do want to get a trike um, well lag just so I could have some uh, movement going on and everything um and uh to possibly gather berry stuff which it's not that bad um but everything you know helps and stuff so 
uh, that'll be something probably be the next dino that I get which we'll probably be doing in an episode here soon um, but today I just want to build and I want really want to get exploring this island and find new places because this obviously is not going to be my permanent home um, this is just a starter base where I'm going to start out uh, you know getting uh, basic dinos um, uh, you know setting up storage a house a base pretty much yeah just a base location and I'll um, find a new place like once we get a um, dino that can fly and everything we'll get a new base location discovered oh that bear is moving now they're no longer stuck on the tree but hopefully he'll stay over in that direction and not bother me hopefully um, yeah so I'll just hope he stays over there um, so I guess we can probably just start putting out some fence foundations. Um, I, let me put them in a slot here, which I know I will need. Actually, I'll do that first. I'll go gather, grab some wood out here to make some more. And that's encumbered me, so we'll craft some more. Oh, that's plenty. I don't even know if I'll be able to carry all those. Hopefully that bear stays over there because I'm kind of stuck here for now. <laughs> Can't move. <sighs> I guess I'll um, bring you uh, back when all these are crafted up and I can move and everything. So um, once they're done crafting, I'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. So all those uh, fence foundations and everything got crafted up. So we have 59 of them um, so far. And while that was crafting, um, I did get another... Uh, level so I pumped again into weight and so now we can um, come down in here and unlock the forge of course that pretty much uses up uh, most of our points and I don't know of anything else right now that I want to buy um, the dinosaur gateway would probably be nice and everything and of course eventually we'll need the feeding trough compost bins um, and all that sort of stuff um, could get a raptor or packy Parasaur, which I um, guess we could possibly do to get a Parasaur. Um, so that way we would have something to move around on. Um, oh, there's a trike. That's probably what I want. So that's when we get another level. That's what I'm going to buy next is that trike. Because that's what I really want to do. Um, okay, so I guess we'll go ahead and start placing... Um, these fence foundations down hopefully this will um, allow us like these 59 will give us a good start and everything um, and hopefully they will place well and I'll probably start right over here and then just go out and around the um, base and everything uh, I don't know exactly I guess we'll start there. I don't know if I've ever um, used the wood ones. I know I've used the stone on my um, other game and everything, but I've never used the wood ones, so I don't know exactly how they work or look and everything, I should say. I know how they work, but um, the look of them to know when they're straight and everything. Because I know the stone ones have the holes on top and everything, so that's kind of what I can use to line up stuff. But this one you just have to kind of place. Um, let's see here. There we go. How far out are we? So we'll go out a little distance um, from our, from the front of our house and everything. I guess our current base location maybe one more and we'll see what it looks like here oh yeah that should be out uh, plenty so it'll give us some more room at least um, and I guess we'll turn in here actually by turning that way I'll probably want to go out one more and then we'll turn in 
So of course do a 90 degree angle here. And go all the way across as far as we can. And then I'll have to do some gathering of wood and everything to get all these walls built or all the walls built to place down. Oh, this is so complicated. There we go. I think that's straight. Yeah. So I think um, I will finish placing these uh, fence foundations and then I'll start gathering uh, wood and everything to build the walls and I'll bring you back when I'm ready to start placing the walls. Okay, and we're back, and so I started uh, crafting some walls. I'm pretty sure I didn't get enough uh, to uh, put up all the way around the base, and as you can see, I got the, um, the fence foundations laid out, and I started to put up some walls and everything, and of course, um, I'll have to uh, put up a new door and everything, which I think I will do right here since these two look uh, relatively flat, and that's what I like instead of like having them on the stair steps here, which I would like to have the door on this side of the base. Um, but since none of them are flat, uh, I guess I'm just going to uh, go with it over here instead. Um, so I'm just going to put um, walls up along the side. Well, um, as you can see, while I was uh, crafting and everything, I got some more levels. Um, I got um, the, what this would be my second level now. And so we have some extra points I can go in and uh, buy that trike saddle now. And... Did I so I did get um, unlock the metal stuff and we do um, have the ability to unlock the smithy so I'll go ahead and do that and then of course the um, pick hatchet and I don't have enough for the pike yet um, but that's uh, gonna be good on, and of course we can get into the crossbows and everything so that's gonna be great and I did see there was the turtle saddle there too um, so we're getting starting to get more advanced and everything at least in the ability of stuff to buy um, so I'll have to get uh, moving on to that stuff soon. So I'm going ahead and putting uh, the walls down. And I'm doing them too high for now, of course. Um, the best height is threes to keep out uh, the um, larger predators and everything like T-Rexes and stuff. Um, but since I know I won't have enough and everything, I'll go ahead and put a um, base of two down for right now. So... Um, We'll go ahead and place all of these. So we'll get moving along through here. And then, like I said, I'm pretty sure I'm going to run out. Um, so I'll have to craft some more. And I was trying to um, uh, put some extra materials into, or some extra wood, I guess, into the chest to refill it. Um, so I wouldn't have to gather as much because I'm kind of... Um, deforesting I guess um, right out in front of my base and everything so I'll have to start traveling farther to get wood um, but it shouldn't be too bad and now I do have uh, the uh, whoa, what's going on here huh I don't know what happened here that's really weird. So, ooh, and that's backwards too. Um, let's go ahead and destroy this and this foundation. Of course, I'm gonna have to go through and take uh, all of these off. Which this side doesn't really matter. I don't know. I guess I can see. I mean, I'd hate to waste all this rock because I could put it in storage, but I'm pretty sure if I hit this, I won't be able to carry it all. Um, I guess I was able to destroy it, and I can carry it too. There's miracles going on here. Um, so I'll store this stone away, because I don't need it right now. And that is full. Of course, just got one metal, so it's not like I'm keeping or got a whole lot going on there. Um... So I did put these fence foundations, so I'll go ahead and pull those back out because I'll probably fix this, especially since I took that rock out. Um, so let's go ahead and place a wall here, and it's placing properly now. 
we'll go ahead and take up all of these fence foundations. So I have no clue what went on, um, but once again, that's a problem with um, the arc building and uh, building with fence foundations, everything, how you can't uh, sleep, uh, sorry, see the ground properly. Um, so let's go ahead and put these fence foundations back on our side. Of course, we only have one more wall, so we'll have to um, place that one and then build more. So let's see if I'm, I think I had one more out. And then it was turned to the side. So let's see if we can line this one up. I assume that it is in the proper spot. Place that one. And then the last one here. There we go. Hopefully those are all in the proper spots now. We'll go ahead and destroy these spike walls and get the wood. So that way we have the wood uh, materials from that to build um, more walls. Of course they won't help too much, but it's better than nothing. So demolish this and we'll go ahead and demolish this door as well. Probably should have done that individually, but oh well. Kind of already did it. Um, looks like we should be good on other materials, so go ahead and grab those. Build as many more walls as we can. And I did go ahead and get the other hat and stuff made and put into storage. So one for me and then one in storage. So it looks like we have what, three, so six, seven, eight, nine. So it looks like we have the proper amount to at least get it too high around whoops around here as long as we don't have any more foundations messed up there we go I'm surprised that one went into the rock like that but oh well it's as long as it works that's all that matters um I do have a lot of weight on me have to see what probably the fence foundations um, but I definitely want to um, get a door made and put up there so let's see what I have on me oh I have some stone and then probably those fence foundations um, add a lot to the weight so I'll go ahead and put those up so I already have a gate so I just need the frame it looks like Build all the weight up in there. Go ahead and pull another set of thatch out and put that stone in. Um, let's see what we need. So it looks like we do need some stone, I guess. I didn't know that required stone. Put those together. Let's go ahead and drop that. And then we'll run out and grab some wood. This tree should hopefully be enough. And then we can make the door. So I'll go in and make the door frame, I guess is what it is. And then we'll put that down. Oh, of course it would do that. <laughs> moved at the last second and so now I have to destroy so now let's see what we need to redo well, it looks like we have enough material to rebuild it so that's always good and this time let's not mess it up how about that so it looks like it's in the proper place there we go and it did place in the proper direction so that is awesome so we'll run up here and get the door Whoa, lag. There we go. And place the door on the front here. So now we have our um, little
base enclosed. I say I would probably say two walls would be good for now. I mean, I haven't seen any signs of T Rexes or anything. The worst things um, that have been around here have been the bears that are all the way over there, and they definitely won't go over a too high wall. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and stick with two. And if I ever see any T Rexes wandering around or anything, that's when I'll worry about switching it to three probably because I don't like the gathering wood part um, wood just takes too long it weighs a lot and everything so it um, doesn't make it very fun to gather materials and everything um, so we have all that I wonder what else we can probably look into getting probably putting up this forge would be um, nice see I think we may need to work on extending some of our base out I wonder what we can do Look. let's grab these foundations out and see what we can place out around here so we can place there but not there let's go and place that for testing so not there not there but we can do out here looks like all the way which will be nice to have but I believe that's probably as far and of course that's all we have so this may work I may try and get some or these chests switched over to the large storage boxes um, since I have that unlocked and so I may try and uh, build some of those and then of course get these switched over to wood and then we'll work on uh, building the uh, uh, forge and so that way we can get metal going and everything so I think I'll work on that and I'll be right back okay and so I think I've finished everything so I have all the foundations and everything switched over to wood um, I got like what eight chests laid out and as um, as you can see there I labeled them all so I've got stone wood thatch fiber hide flint weapons and miscellaneous and I got two forges put up and um, so I'll go ahead and light those to get this metal that I got um, while getting the uh, stone for the forges and everything so we'll get those crafting up and then um, while working or while doing stuff I got levels and everything so I was able to get the um, smith myth here you may have already seen that um so i need to work on that but i need the metal for it and then i also got the turtle saddle which i'd like to get but i need the cementing paste um so that way i can put it on mikey and stuff and then uh get that going so that is going um i guess probably um to be it for today um for or for this episode at least um so i'll see you guys next time um, I hope you enjoyed the episode. Don't forget um, to subscribe for more videos and um, hopefully more ARC videos and stuff. Um, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>